these are the vertical lines. No display. You may think it is a decal, which has an issue. You may think it is a mainboard or screen. So I'm going to show you how you can check whether that is a screen, a mainboard or decal. We are going to lose any more of these screws. Uh, this is a power board and uh, this is a tick on here and uh, this is main board and here this is a LVDS cable low voltage differential signal and these are speakers this one left right and left speaker so what we are going to see sorry what we are going to do here is to check the voltage here going to the tick on so you are going to do it in a two steps when the panel is connected and when the panel is disconnected so we are going to present this shield in here As you can see, this is a Ticon timing controller board. Uh, this is a cable going to, to the panel, to the screen. So we are going to put it on to supply it with power, electrical power. I hope you can see backlights are on here. You can check here. These are backlights.
So using this digital multimeter, so we are going to check voltages. You see the panel is connected. This LVDS cable is connected. So we are going to check all voltages if they are present when the panel, when the screen is connected. So here we are going to start on V in. I hope you can see here. V in here. Here. So we are going to check VGL voltage here. Voltage is zero. Hope you can see visual voltage is try to to increase and decreasing so it is somehow zero so now you are going to check vgh so you are going to check vgh voltage here vgh voltage is not stable it is changing So VGH voltage is changing, it is not stable, Since it is changing from 0 to 19 and from 19 to 0. Let us also check VDD here. It is also changing from 15 to 0, from 0 to 15. It is not stable. You can also check HVDD. Also changing some voltages are not are not present, others are not as are changing. So now we are going to disconnect this LVDS and then we check to see if all voltages are st stable, not changing, the panel is 40. If they are keep changing, this T cone is 40. First, I have to switch it off. Yeah, this is a power on the button. You can see it is off now. Now we, we have to disconnect this cable, to disconnect the panel. See now it is disconnected. So now you are going to recheck voltages if they are present, if they are not changing. After disconnecting the panel, after disconnecting the after disconnecting the panel, so after disconnecting this cable,
VGH you can see it is minus 4.8 it is okay VDD 15 15.2 volts Twenty-six point seven. Twenty-six point seven volts. It is stable, not changing. It is okay. HVDD seven point five volts. So this is how you can check your LG TV thirty two inches when. It is, has an issue of displaying vertical lines, changing vertical lines, or moving vertical lines. So you have to check whether this T-cone is being supplied by 12 volts from here to this fuse, and you have to check VDD, VGH, VGL, HVDD when the panel is connected and then after disconnected this cable from this cable is going to the panel if you disconnect this cable you disconnect the screen after disconnecting the screen you also have to check to check voltages so if voltages are not present before or after Disconnecting the panel, this T-con is bad. But if voltages are okay, after disconnecting the panel, the panel is defective. The panel is causing like short circuit. And after causing the short, short circuit, this T-con goes in pro protection mode. Hello engineers, I hope you have seen how you can check LG TV when it has moving vertical lines. So I hope this video has helped you out. If you have a comment, let me know in a comment section. If you have a problem, let me know in a comment section. Thank you for watching. See you in my next videos.